Green living is the life for me. I just love sustainability. Hey, I'm Rick Gardner and this is my blog, Green Living. Uh, my goal is to lower my carbon footprint and talk about the latest trends and topics, help other people be more sustainable and live green. So today I'm talking about uh, some of the things that are simple that you can do around the house that saves money and lowers your carbon footprint. The first and probably the easiest is your thermostat. Um, if you will set your thermostat at a lower temperature during the winter and a higher temperature during the summer, that's one big way to save a lot of money. The other thing is get yourself a programmable thermostat. What I like about this, it was less than $50. You can buy it at Home Depot or any of the other home uh, improvement locations. and. Uh, the uh, money that you save more than pays for itself in a short time. Next step uh, I would recommend is to uh, replace and clean or um, yeah, clean or replace your filters uh, on your HVAC on a monthly basis. Um, sometimes it's hard to remember that so set yourself up with a little trip wire like uh, something on your calendar to remind yourself that it's time to do that. Um, another another tip is to make sure when you're using your dishwasher that you have a full load. So make sure the whole dishwasher is full. And then uh, another thing idea is to set it so that it does it at night when you're asleep, uh, and uh, energy costs less less to to um, to pay for. And then, last but not least, is your ceiling fan. Um, as you can see, our ceiling fan right here um, is using CFL bulbs. And the other thing is to make sure that the direction of the fan blades are going the right direction for the time of year. During the uh, winter, you want um, the uh, heat, the hot air, to be pushed down so the blade should go clockwise. And during the summer, you want the cool air to be coming down so it will be going counterclockwise. You'll see there's a little switch up here that you would flip to change the direction. So I'm Rick Gardner. Thank you for following my blog. And if you have any ideas uh, or suggestions, please email me at apexgardner at gmail.com. Thanks.